We're at the Leo Mole Sculpture Garden. Now, Leo Mall was a famous sculpture from Manitoba. And that's Schoolgirl. And it's combined with, you can see all the sculptures coming along, with the gardens. This is Echo. That's Margica. And this is the entrance to it. Whoever thought I would be artsy fartsy, that's the bather. And you come as you walk in there's all kinds of tributes and stones. They donated to the museum. The Leo Mole Sculpture Garden is quite a place to relax, to enjoy nature, and to look at some incredible art. The garden was unveiled on June 18, 1992, and has been expanded twice since its inception. There are over 300 pieces of art. Now I could only show a little bit here today and I hope you're enjoying it very much. Dr. Leo Moll was short for Leonid Moldo Shannon, who was born in the Ukraine. 
Leo Moll studied art at various places, Leningrad Academy of Arts, Berlin's Kunst Academy, and the Academies of Arts in The Hague. Moll migrated to Winnipeg, Manitoba, Canada in 1948 with his wife Margaret, and he continued to do art right up until his passing in 2009. In 1990, the Lumberjack sculpture was featured on the 48 cents Canadian stamp. Early in the 1960s, Leo Moll purchased a small schoolhouse where he created his art. By 1995, this schoolhouse, which was located in Birdsale, Manitoba, was moved to the Leo Moll Sculpture Garden and it was restored and now sits as a green and white building for people to go into, except for right now there's COVID so it's temporarily closed. Well, my peeps, we're done with being on location with me, Scott, and I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to leave a like. That's all I ask. If you leave a comment, great. I'll uh, get to you sooner or later. But a like is important. And uh, until I see you again, cheers.